Hi, my name is Brooke Sheets, and this is my cameraman, Justin Gabbridge. Hey. I'm going to show you guys how to work at a shoe store. First off, you need to make sure you're on time, and once you get here, you need to come over to the computer and clock in, and then put your code in, and then once you're in, you're in for good, and then you can clock out when you leave. After that, you have to come over to the sign-in, sign-in out sheet. You sign in and sign out here. And then once every, like, when the customers walk through the door, you need to make sure you greet them. For example, say, hi, welcome to Shoe Show. And then you let them walk around for a few minutes. And then once the few minutes is up, you can, go, you can approach them and ask them if they need any help. And if they don't, just let them be for a while. And then now I'm going to show you some stuff we do on a daily basis. Okay, now I'm going to show you guys how to rerun. First off, our shoes go in a snake pattern and they're separated by brand. So you have to put each of the, you have to look at the names of the shoes on the boxes and put them in. And then you can start up here. This is the same shoe. And then once you run out of that shoe, then you start with the next. And sometimes if you don't have very many shoes, it can be easy for you to not be able to face them. So you have to have, a sho have the shoes facing on the top row, in the middle, and on the very bottom. So if you don't have enough room, you can always restart the run by starting the shoes up here or down here. Now I'm going to show you where to get a shoe if a customer comes up to you and asks you because sometimes we keep the left shoe in the back for the brand name shoes to help from theft. So let's go back to our bathroom to where we keep them all. First off, you need to look at the number on the box and on the shoe and make sure the shoes in the right box because we have we have numbers written on the bottoms of the shoe and there's numbers on the shelf and that's where the shoe will be. So this number is 620. So we'll go over to 620. Here's the shoe. So make sure it's the left shoe. Make sure it's the same size. And then this is what you do to go get a shoe. Now I'm going to show you what we do constantly throughout the store. Um, see how all the shoes are a mess. Well, we have to make sure all the shoes are zoned. They all have to be facing the right way. This is facing the wrong way. And this box is completely in the wrong spot. It should be facing right here. And then if there's a box on the floor, we need to pick it up and see where it goes. This is the triple, double, black, gray, and red. So this is where this is. Place it there. <clears throat> and you just have to make sure everything is zoned properly. Now I'm going to talk about closing the store. First, you need to make sure all the mirrors are cleaned off. You will need to use this and some paper towels. And you'll go over here. Make sure all the fingerprints are. You have to go around the store and make sure every mirror is cleaned off. And after this is finished, you need to walk back to the back and get the vacuum and make sure the whole floor is swept to make sure all the trash is on the floor. Pick up this trash and make sure all of the trash is cleaned up. And then after all 
all that is finished, we just need to make sure all the registers are closed, the lights are turned off, and the doors are locked. So I hope you guys have learned a little something about closing a shoe store. A nine. <laughs> Wait, can we read my face? Really? What? Are you recording me? Dun, is that dun, light gonna dun. be in my head the whole time? My eyes are bright. Change your mouth. Here I go. You can cut it out I can cut it. with Camtasia. Oh. Okay. Hi, I'm going to show you all how to work. <laughs> Wait, start over. You got the whole <laughs>